Now we're gonna talk about the use of L-dopa or levodopa in the treatment of Parkinson's disease. So here is the brain and here's the blood. So this is the blood brain barrier. The problem in Parkinson's that I cannot give dopamine because dopamine cannot pass the blood brain barrier access denied. So how to get around this? We give L-dopa, okay? And L-dopa will go through the blood brain barrier and after going inside the brain, it will be converted via a enzyme into dopamine. And this decarboxylase enzyme will change the dopa into dopamine. Dopamine, this is our goal in Parkinson's. So, but there are some caveats here. Number one, dopa can be converted into 3-O-methyldopa, which is useless by an enzyme called COMT. So to prevent that, we give another drug called tolcapone, or we can use another drug called intacapone. The difference is that tolcapone can lead to liver toxicity. That's, you can remember that tolcapone has a huge toll on the liver. Then, the same happens in the brain. The dopa can be converted to 3-O-methyldopa, in the CNS, so we need to give tolcapone or entecapone to inhibit this enzyme, the COMT. The second challenge is that there is an enzyme called MOAB, monoamine oxidase, subtype B, and it will convert the dopamine, which is very useful, into useless inactive metabolites. So we give selegiline, it's a medication that inhibits the MAO-B enzyme to make dopamine more available by preventing its breakdown. Okay, but take care because selegiline is metabolized into amphetamines so they, you may see some adverse effects on the patient. The third challenge is that the L-dopa in the periphery can be converted into dopamine, which cannot cross the blood-brain barrier. So I'm giving a drug called carbidopa, which inhibits this decarboxylase enzyme, but it works only on the periphery. It will not work here. So I'm happy. Why? Dopa is not converted into dopamine in the periphery, but it is converted into dopamine in the CNS, which is the goal of the treatment. So that's it. Like we have, we give L-dopa, but we have three challenges. Okay. Number one, in the periphery, it can be converted into dopamine by the enzyme, the decarboxylase enzyme. How to prevent that? Give carbidopa. Challenge number two, both in the periphery and in the CNS, the dopa can be converted into 3-O-methyldopa, which is useless, so we give either tolcapone or intecapone. Take care because tolcapone has liver toxicity as a side effect. Okay, then the L-dopa, after going through the blood-brain barrier into the brain, can face the, a third challenge, which is metabolism by MAO-B enzyme, into inactive metabolite. How to prevent that? We give selegiline. That's it. Treatment of Parkinson's by using of dopa, carbidopa. And also we give tolcapone and selegiline. That's it. Thank you.